Hi Internet, today I want to share how I created this fish illustration. I took a photo of a fish and put it into Illustrator. I placed a reference photo on a different layer and started making triangles using a pen tool. If you see complex areas in an image, make a triangle smaller. If you see simple areas, make triangles bigger. As easy as that. I finished making triangles of my fish and now I wanna do a background. I use a website for it, because it's fast and I don't need many details. I drag the reference photo to this website, play with sliders and download an SVG file. I open this file and now I copy the background and paste it into my fish illustration document. Now it's time to color the triangles of a fish. I use three shortcuts to make it happen. First one is backslash, to remove the color of a selected object. The second one is eye, a dropper tool, to color the triangle from an image color. And the last one is V, selection tool, to select the next triangle. Also, if you use Ctrl Shift B shortcut, it will hide the bounding box of selected objects, making it easier to select other triangles fast. Ok, I colored the entire fish. What's next? As we've done all the monotonous work, the fun part begins. I decided this fish needed more saturation. In this stage, you, you should think about the environment of an object you do. Think about things you can add to the background. Think about the details of your illustration. Maybe you need to add some more details. Perhaps the color is not right in some spots. Play with the program and use the tools it gives you. Make a good work. And also some wisdom. Can't say it's from me, but it's a good one. If you think you have finished the artwork, Wait for the next day. Look at it the next day and you'll probably find a thing or two that you don't like. Change them and then you can confidently say you're done. The last part of the video I did on the second day. I might have finished working on this illustration on the first day, but it would have been much worse than it is right now.
Okay, folks, thanks for watching. Hope this video was helpful for you. See you in the future.